Hey guys, wow. welcome back to Yelan App. For today's video, we are going to show you how to fix Shopify domain error needs attention. So if you're interested, let's start a tutorial. So if you see the domain needs attention error in Shopify, it means there's an issue with how your domain name is linked to your Shopify store. So first is you need to check your Shopify admin dashboard for specific error messages. Now it will mention any type of DNS record issue here such as missing or incorrect A records or C name records. Now in this case, what we need to do is we need to go to settings here and you want to go ahead and access section for domains. Let's go ahead and click on this one. So in this case, if you do see any error here, you need to go ahead and fix them. Now, in this case, uh, what we need to do next here is we need to update our DNS records. So typically, you need to log into your domain registers control panel where you uh, manage your domain. So look for DNS settings or DNS management here. This is where you can update your domain's DNS records. Now, in this case, you need to update the DNS records according to instructions Shopify provides you. So Shopify usually gives you detailed steps on for various domain registers. Now again, you just need to go to your settings here, go to domains, and typically you have the option to see, or in this case, select connect new domain here. And from here, you can just add your domain and they will give you the instructions on how to do that exactly. Now, in this case, you might also might, uh, need to check your prop uh, propagation delay. So in this case, DNS changes can take up to 40 hours to fully propagate across the internet. So even after fixing the issue, you might still see the error for a while as the changes take effect here. Also, some domain registers require a period at the end of the domain name in DNS records. Like for example, you could have shops.myshopify.com with a training period instead of shops.myshopify.com. Now, in this case, uh, you could also contact support if you are unsure in fixing this issue. So, in this case, you could go to the top right here, go to my store or your store name here. You want to go to help center. Now, in this case, you should be able to see a chatbot at the right side here. You could request a uh, interaction or a uh, real agent. In this case, you could ask the chatbot to have a conversation or a meeting with a actual agent itself. Now, you could also visit the community uh, link that they have. So typically, you could just go to community.shopify.com. And typically, they will give you an uh, option to uh, have interaction with different people that already have or solve this problem here. So in this case, you could post or ask your own questions or even search for different questions or uh, guides here that you could actually do. Now, in this case, that's about it. So hopefully, this video was able to help you like and subscribe to the app. Thank you for watching.